Welcome back. <gasps> Adventurers. Yeah. Hey. I mean, we didn't do Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you are on the road. You're traveling in a cart, some of you. You have found Nutmeg again, the very deaf horse. And you have some barrels of expensive Lendar red wine. It's Lendar red in the... That's right. Oh, yes. Oh, shit. You should have paid attention to what I said. Can I put some yeah. water skin? <laughs> not while you're driving. <laughs> That's you right. Can't, you can't drive a cart and drink. You're I not mean. my mom. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not driving, so, though. You're in the cart. The Green Mother's with you. You're on your way to the Vernau Estate, where Hammerlane should be there. And one of you is back in Elurin, where you learned Hammerlane left town Shit. in a rush because she got grave news about Kaleva. She has traveled there. You are with Aurora and a very surly Nightjar who has given up his necklace so that you could send a message to the other group. But you did, letting them know to meet you. Aurora takes you out back where she has set up a cart and they've removed all of the very full barrels of ale and instead filled her cart with empty barrels for you to travel in. Mm, it's a good thing we're bringing one. We're back on the road. Are you ready? Two, roll! Yes! Ah! yes! All right. All right, we're going to start in Elyorin with Aurora and Eleni. All right, I'm gonna climb back in one of these small spaces, which I thoroughly enjoy. But before I do, I have a question. I imagine most alcohol flows through this establishment at some point or another. Or one of the many taverns across Elyorin. Right, well, I am... Um, did you go to the Fox's Brew? It's excellent. Yes, no, I did not. But I, I oh, did, however... It's your loss. Well, you know, we'll be back. We'll have more time to party. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, but, you know... Bumble! Yes, I don't, I don't know. Yes, a little bumble. You didn't I didn't bumble. play. I was... Next time. ...running through it's the working. streets. Anyways, it's... Um, what I'm looking for is a uh, lavender gin that uh, we had with Hamelin. Did, do you have any of that? Only Hammerlane has it, I yeah, know. of course she does. I wish. We've tried to buy it from her, but apparently it takes a lot of magic and uh, time to make, so, <laughs> yeah. Right. She doesn't give it to just anybody. Right, yes, of course. Maybe she has some with her when I find her. All right, I guess I will. Um... I mean, she probably can't have too much left. She has been uh, drinking, you know, <laughs> it's a party. Sure, mm. yes. Although, not yesterday and today as much, I guess. Ugh. Right. Yeah, no, it's been a little crazy lately. Right? I mean, uh, you know. Cheese. And then, I mean, I don't know surely what outfit should I bring. I mean, we're going on this, like, secret stealth mission. Should I wear what I'm currently wearing? You know, just my regular tavern stuff. But I'm going to probably stick around if you guys let me and participate. So maybe I should wear, like, a sneaky detective outfit. <laughs> yes. Look at your face. I think you should wear... Clothing. She's like holding up different things of different colors. That one. That looks. That would look great. I think. This is look... my dancing dress. And and and. You know what? And, I do look good in it, though. Yeah. Right. So hey, I'm just gonna get in the barrel. So... That's what I'm gonna do. I mean, I'm just gonna. You know, you <laughs> choose your. I'm she starts undressing start in front of you. It's, no, it's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Is that thing gonna fit in that barrel? <laughs> Pokes a hole in the barrel. <laughs> Luckily, she, she'd already told the crew helping to load up the barrels for her to leave the, a hole open so that you can breathe. Not just for, you know. Not just for peeping. Not, not just for that. <laughs> Get dirty paper. Get nasty paper. No, 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 that's him. Okay. <laughs> you're in you're watching a... Either. I mean, she knows you're watching. She's putting her I'm own. not watching! <laughs> <laughs> uh, and you can hear her... People are coming over to help her out. Two large horses are being hooked up. Although, now, probably doesn't need quite that much strength, but they don't know that those are not full barrels. And you 
here, move through the gates, through town, you're out on the road. You are traveling on the other side of the lake. So as you move on the other side, you don't see each other, but you are both en route to the estates. Back at the crew who's in the cart with the green mother. Uh, I'm going to pull out one of those cigars that I was so generously given, and I'm just gonna. Uh, so now? Yeah. Do you have a light? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Thanks. So I got my cigar and my little wine skin, which was a water skin. He knows the way. I'm just cool. here for show. Cool. Uh, so you got those from a noble. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. Do a quick constitution roll for oh, me. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Those always go so well for Aaron. <laughs> uh, constitu- oh, right up here. Mm. Not a saving throw, just a check. 15? Mm-hmm. Uh, okay, so the first thing you notice is the taste of it is not quite like a cigar that you're used to. There's a little something else in there. <gasps> Definitely something else in there. Oh, shit. Skunky green. <laughs> Skunky green. Skunky green. Indeed. Paladin's got a blunt. There's <laughs> <laughs> a little something else mixed into that with that tobacco. Uh, and you guys all, you can smell it. I... Do I recognize uh, nature check? <laughs> nature check? Yeah, I like to make that nature check as well. I don't know shit. <laughs> <laughs> Does that count? Yeah, I know what it is. Uh, 18. <laughs> <laughs> okay, six. Well. Okay, and I, I rolled, uh, I rolled a two, so four total. You, uh, not, not, not a huge surprise. Elendar has no idea what that smell is. <laughs> it smells you, like one of my masters. You think you're? <laughs> <laughs> you're yeah, worried I haven't smelled that, they, that since my college days. <laughs> <laughs> you're worried that the is horse that? might have hit a like stumbled, yeah. stomped all over a little skunk or something, maybe. That's not so pleasant. Okay. Yeah, pass, uh, pass, pass that on. <laughs> uh, shipmates, there's something strange about this. <laughs> yeah, I just need to give it a test, you know? Uh, I feel strange. <laughs> <laughs> so, Rathana, we were in the middle of a conversation. <laughs> Like a perfect. I got a 12. Do I, do I know? You know what it is. Okay, perfect. <laughs> <laughs> so the past over here. Just Thanks a so much. Cigar, as far as I know. Just a vampire child. It's a smelly, smelly yeah. one. I forgot what I asked. What was it about? It was about the Arrhenius, about uh, Estrabel. Estrabel. Yeah. Oh yeah. And from 30 years. Why ago. you knew about that? If you weren't involved. What happened? Great. Have I told you how great I think you guys are? No, please don't. What's up with your ears? My ears are perfectly normal. Nice okay, we're gonna calm this down a bit. We'll come back and let you guys do a round of these. Um, <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Careful with the t- Bunch of stuff we cannot reenact. Yeah, okay, uh, so we'll come back around the table for a little bit of this. I didn't but put it in. <laughs> while <laughs> you're discussing with the Green Mother mm-hmm. a bit about what she knows. Just doing it again. <laughs> <laughs> Just do breathe so, it. So yeah, about uh, uh, Estravel. The Arrhenius. Why do you, if you weren't involved last 30 years ago, why do you know what happened? A magic user from Elurin came to the grove to ask me questions. (coughs) (laughs) (laughs) To find out if I knew anything about it. Do you know who this magic user was? No, I did not ask their name. What does they look like? Human. I'm gonna roll to see if she's lying again. Uh, Easy there, Mori Povich. <laughs> uh, 25. Hmm. Uh, you get the impression that she's not being totally honest with you. Okay. So, nothing of event happened? It seems odd that you're remembering this and then we're asked questions like, mm, what else happened here? Come on. It's not my story to tell. 
Whose is it? We are going to talk to Hamelaine, and perhaps she will divulge more information to you if you ask her. So is Hammerlane. So <laughs> when you fought Hammerlane and were captured, that wasn't the first time you guys had interacted. It is not. Ah. Mm. But it was the first time you guys engaged in combat. Definitely the first time that we fought. All right. It is always sad when a great warrior such as Hamelaine must resort to violence against a friend. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Which is sadly, as I understand, quite common in her life. Mm. Yeah, apparently she's done a lot of stuff. Maybe that's why she's so cranky. Anytime it's, you lose a friend. Did. Yeah, it's not, not ideal to have to kill your friends. As you guys are traveling in this cart, Nutmeg, who hears nothing <laughs> on the road, just traipsing along, but you start to hear the sounds of another cart. Horses. Ahead or behind? They are slightly behind you, but you are both coming around the lake. Oh, I just want to take a look to see if I, when I hear it, like, Going on over there. Roll perception. I'll do that as I'll well. I'll do the two. I'm gonna slow nutmeg down so that this cart ends up ahead. Um, their cart, the other one? Mm -hmm. 22. 17. 20. Good number. Are you also perceptioning? Mm -hmm. Uh, 15. Okay, so all of you can make out a cart full of barrels, and you notice at the front, leading the cart, driving it. Dark hair that ends in teal curls. Mm. Oh! Her very colorful dancer's dress from the <laughs> night of Bumble Cups. Right on. And all of the beads and jangly bits of it on her shawl that she's draped over herself for travel. Right. Keep that away from the jag man. Are we inside or just on top of this cart? You are sitting in assorted it's parts a cart, of not it. A just, it's open. Yeah, it's open. We're yeah. Just, okay. And, and some of you are sitting on crates and some of you are sitting beside barrels. Okay. And can are we in an eye shot that she could see us? She has not noticed you yet? Oh. Flippity gibbets. Hey Rara! And you Thank see God our horse is deaf. Head turns and she waves at you all. Hey! Uh uh Aaron, pull up beside the cart there. That's not how a road works. This isn't like a off-road, but just get ahead and stop. Uh, all right, nutmeg. On, boy. Hey, Rara. You'll have to whip yes, him. Yes, that's the opposite of what we want. You'll have to whip him. I think it's time for you to not drive. I think you just, I uh, <laughs> just pull on the... And you arrive. They're ahead of us. Yeah. I got to make him go fast if you want me to pull it about. Well, that's why you have to whip him. No, she said that she slowed down so that the cart would end up yeah. ahead. Okay. Yeah. Because it's basically better. you arrive on the larger, <laughs> wide road heading to the estate, <laughs> traveling as two carts. Oh, there you go. Wait, go back. And I want to talk about horses. Yeah, Aurora yeah. pulls. Yeah, yeah. Pull them over. Then to a stop. Hey. Whoa. Jump off. <laughs> Hustle over. Hey. <laughs> um, where are you going? She jumps down into your arms. Oh. <gasps> plants a big kiss on you. Oh, damn. <laughs> hey. Uh, nice to see you, too. I have Alanine, one of the barrels. <gasps> I saw a nice kid. What? <laughs> wait, 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 Aren't they? I learned their dialect. No, I'm, oh. I'm still in a, in a fucking barrel here. Oh, oh, look, there's there. there. but, oh, and she sees amongst you the green mother. We have a new friend. Oh, yeah. Maybe it's a green mother. She's changed the barrel place with you. That's a great idea. We have a friend. Yeah. Did somebody please let me out? Uh, <laughs> very uncomfortable. I'll take it out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no let him out. We should talk about this and figure this no, out. No, no, no. Let's, uh, let's give him some time in there. <laughs> Fuck you, Elf. 
God damn it. I think you could probably just like push the thing. Yeah, push the lid off. Actually, I'll I'll help you, and I uh, I'll just just gently jump jump over to uh, to his cart and just uh, sit on top of the. the Wait, <laughs> I climb up beside uh, Elendor and I sit down beside him. Yeah. Just, and I lean just, over and I'm like, just sat on you're top of the Just hang barrel. out in there for a minute. I'm hurt with my hands above my head. Oh, that's that's really unfortunate. I'll just hang on. I'll get you out. You're pushing so a disadvantage. Out. Push harder. Are all the barrels Almost empty? Dead. Okay, all now. The barrels have right. air in them. All the barrels on my cart are empty, so that you could all fit inside. Huh? How many barrels are there? There's six barrels. Oh, so there's six of you. Well, 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 I can drive oh. the wine cart, and you can put the green mother in my barrel. Sure, someone else has um, to drive the other cart. That's a great be, idea. Okay, if we're going to the estate, it's the... Wait, is the wedding tomorrow still? Yes. Tomorrow. Yeah, so uh, I think I made a pretty good impression on Dallin, so if he sees me driving the cart, mm. he won't ask questions, and mm -hmm. I can say, look, we found your wine. Mm -hmm. I don't know that you talk to him at all. No. Mm -hmm. I made a very good impression with Burke. Yeah, mm -hmm. totally. <laughs> I did some singing. <laughs> <laughs> and I stepped my foot down on I'll top of the barrel. Shut up, Ali! Oh, Eleanor. Just a finger coming out of the hole. <laughs> and I say, uh, I, I, I pop the, 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 oh. the barrel open and I'm like, I'm in your head now. <laughs> you know what, Elf? <laughs> I'm just gonna... Put it down! Let me sit down again. <laughs> oh. You pop out to get oh. a breath of fresh air. Uh. Aurora steps away from you brushing uh, up against you as much as possible uh, as she leaves, and you feel something maybe strapped to her thigh as she leaves your presence. Something other than a tail? Something other than a tail. <laughs> She's got something strapped on, eh? She notices, she notices <laughs> like you notice. Women's Day. She notices you notice. Yeah. And she says, well, a girl doesn't travel without some protection. A banana, are you happy to see me? What's your, uh, what's your protection of choice there? It's a dagger, I'll show you later, Rick. Oh. Okay, just ask me. Mm. Uh, wait, wait. seen my dagger, so. What are we doing? <laughs> um, <laughs> oh, right, oh, Jesus. Jesus. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> so we're gonna, everybody's gonna get inside the barrels. Someone else will drive the cart with the wine. Um, and then I think we drink wine. And then, I guess, I, I don't know what else you guys have planned. So wait. I'm assuming since you're going here that Hammerlane's... Yes, she heard some bad news about Kaleva. Did you what? speak into his mind? What? No, stop yes. it. How'd you do that? Oh, Catman. He had oh. a stone that I smashed. What happened to Kaleva? To speak to you. I don't know what happened to Kaleva, but something terrible apparently. So Hammerlane had to teleport herself there. Aurora? Like that's how urgent it was or something. Aurora, what happened to Kaleva? Oh, for fuck's sake, let's go. Everyone in the barrel. Whose cart, whose cart is going first? You know, if it's just... Do you guys all need to go to the estate? Because I could just take the Green Mother there. I mean, I could make her it's invisible, it. and we could just... No, we'll we'll keep her no her she us. stays right she with us, thank you. She stays with us. Yeah. Does she need a guard? She has yeah, She one. does, absolutely. Yeah. She's yeah. a very yeah. cool. special person. All right. Well, um, I mean, obviously. I mean, once again, I would they not walk her, her in there. She's right on. Let's talk to talkie More people. No, we should put the Green Mother in a barrel if she's willing to do so. She's a protector, actually. She's a protector. Um, come here for a sec. I'm gonna pull Arn aside. Okay, we will go to Arn and Murik after we do a quick round with everyone else here, starting with the Green Mother, and then we'll go um, around the circle. Just check in what you're doing, if you're gonna get into a barrel, what your plan is. And the Green Mother looks over at you as you guys are attempting to get to your own conversation. I would really prefer not to get inside a smelly barrel, but if that is all that is available to me as an option. It's not. To see Hamelaine, um, I, mean, I will do I would, what I must. I would tell you that um, when I got back to the city, people were in a little bit of an uproar. They were definitely looking to kill you. So whilst I think, you know, having just been in a barrel, I agree, not the most comfortable way to travel, I would say that you might want to get in because if they see you, I very much think they want to kill you. Without question. Right I away. I am quite disappointed in the people of Elirin. Yes. Well, I mean, I'm, I'm not surprised. People are generally negative, let's say. You know, in my experience growing up in this world. 
But I would say that this is probably our best way to get you to Hammerlane. It'll be the quickest, safest way that we can get a private conversation. Wait, Bernie? This is the fastest way to get her to Hamelin, and Hamelin is there? Yes. At the Venar Estate. Something's wrong with Kaleva. She went to go check. I don't know what. But... So she's there and she's waiting. Yes, I mean, she's not expecting us, but if we have the Green Mother in a barrel and we maybe bring, you know, Hamelin over to the barrel, we can have a quick conversation without anybody knowing. <laughs> but if anybody at Venau sees the Green Mother there, they will attempt to arrest her immediately. Right. Yeah. Oh, Seems like okay. a straightforward plan. I think we should just move ahead with it. Yeah. So, the Green Mother takes barrel number one. Seno. Yeah, I don't want to get in a barrel. I'm gonna sit uh, on the wine cart and be like, hello, when we get to all help talk to the people at the very, very, uh, very disarming hello. <laughs> I will happily get into the barrel next to the green mother. She takes your hand to get her assistance laying into the barrel and ducks in. Oh. Slippery Elm, because it has a funny name. Willow. Nice. Weeping. <laughs> <laughs> the Sanguine, are you taking a barrel? I'm absolutely not taking a barrel. Uh, there's, what's the cart that's behind the main cart? There, two carts are right next to each other right now. Oh, there is the cart that. with wine okay. and assorted other crates and business, scavenged or stolen, unclear. Okay, I'm going to uh, stay with the, the cart that's filled with wine, and I'm child sanguina now. And uh, I, I'm just going to... Baby... M m m m roll and add your, your proficient to this, so... I am, yes. Roll and add your proficiency. For the actor? The actor feat? For your disguise. Okay. I just want to know how good it is. Okay. Um, so, 15, 16, 18. Dang, you do look, look like a much younger version of you. Child. Sure. It's very young. Like, like 12, 13, something? 13? Yeah. 13. It's okay. That was what you were going for. I was going for 13, 12, 13. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. I'm just going to, uh, I'm going to crouch so between the barrels. You're crouched between barrels. Yeah. So Looking is sitting up. Yeah, up on the like, front bench. Yep, front bench. Uh, we'll come back to you guys because you're going to do a little conversation. Alany. Yeah, I'm going to crumble as I crawl back in a barrel and hang <laughs> <laughs> and Aurora comes over and she puts the lid on and she looks over at you as you are helping the Green Mother and then getting into your own barrel. <laughs> I just have questions about Okay, gosh. You're fun to play pommel cups with. Okay. <laughs> Puts the lids on. <laughs> You're fun to play bumble cups with, right? <laughs> All one word? <laughs> Holy shit. Um, <clears throat> Aaron, that, um, that thing you can do where you can like detect evil mm -hmm. in a certain area, I'm not 100% sure I trust the Green Mother. Oh. And you said that Hammer Lane was like definitely good, right? Yeah. Yeah. So maybe are you? How, how often can you do that? Is it like a once a day kind of thing? Or? I believe I have several times a day in really? between long rests that okay. I can do it. Yes. Because I mean, maybe while she's trapped in a barrel, is a good time to find out if she's evil or not. Yes. Okay. I'd like to use my just sort of very quietly as I can as I'm undoing my armor because this ain't gonna fit in no barrel. Touch the top as soundlessly as I can, and I cast divine sense. And it expands out from you. And the radius? I believe it's 30, 60 feet. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. That is not behind total cover. She's in a barrel. Oh, crap. There's an air hole. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Okay. I'm take my little fingery thing and I'm going to stick it in her air hole. Air hole. Air hole. Oh, you're... What is you're, it with you and ears? You're just hearing what, what you want. <laughs> <laughs> you're the green mother. Yes, you go to there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm coming for you. Uh, you find what Willy sense. <laughs> <laughs> this yeah. is a weird. This is a weird ask. Um, 
Uh, okay. So you stick your finger in the barrel and you're gonna try to d- detect. M- good like testing warm water, yeah. Testing uh-huh. evil water. <laughs> Um, so it spreads out from around you and, I guess, focused into the barrel. Uh, and the sense that you get from where your hand is and close to you is immediately good. Um, conflicted, though. There is a bit of swirling strangeness, and you're not sure if it's because of what's in the barrel or that somewhere near you there is more evil. Surprise, bitch. Aurora. Uh, Something's Kim. Oh. stinky. Uh, but it's not <laughs> her. I apologize in advance. Uh, <laughs> there's some kind of fiend nearby. Are you sure it isn't Sup's ear? Uh, uh, metagame? Uh, are tieflings evil by default? No, it's not no. evil. It's, um... They are not. Yeah. Their tiefling nature does not define their alignment. Okay. It does include cool. fiends uh, and celestials and undead. Okay. So, and she detects what? Something that is evil or? No, it's a conflict. It's not necessarily evil. Oh. You are getting good and evil swirling mm-hmm. together. Very. Oh. Like a twist cone? Yeah. <laughs> like soft <laughs> serve with both colors. Yeah. They're delicious. I, I like mean, those. good, but always kind of wrong. Yeah, no, they're right. I don't see the problem with it. Me neither. <laughs> I'm done with the swirl. You guys aren't here. <laughs> <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> Whatever right. it is, it's directly in your near front of you vicinity is this it's swirl. Definitely immediately nearby. So the, the finger in the barrel is good. Okay. But there's something else very evil nearby. Like immediately nearby, like as in one of us ate. Surprise! Mm. All right. Cool. Well, let's continue on. Are we but... sure not Meg is deaf? So are you guys, Aurora peeks out from, Ugh. are you guys gonna get in barrels? You're gonna drive? Maybe you wanna sit up front with me? I'll get in the barrel, but I need to take my armor off. Are you you're jumping in? Seno, you're driving, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm driving. Yeah. Uh, Rurik, uh, I'm going to put my upper paladin flap over my armor here, and can you just make sure it's all together and safe? Yeah, you seem good. All right, thank you. All right. Getting in the barrel. Um, yeah, I'll ride with you. Great. Yeah, sounds great. Uh, Everyone's in barrels, or... I need a lid. Oh, here. Um, be ready to pop out in case anything goes sideways. I'm unarmed, you idiot. Okay, fine. All right. <laughs> I'm going to have a nap. It's and I've brought my wine skin. <laughs> <laughs> night, night! <laughs> okay, so everybody's in the barrels. Lindsay has caught, I'm in the wine cup. Good so two, two driving the cart, it's Seno and Sanguina with the wine. And my cigar, I left it up there. Four but I brought my wine skin. And then Rurik and Aurora. <laughs> 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 I reach out with my spindly little creepy vampire. No, we can't have children smoking on the show. (laughs) (laughs) And we're fucked. She built a child. Okay. All right. Everyone else is in barrels. (laughs) Chris, I'm so sorry. (laughs) And Aurora starts to drive her cart forward. Smoking generic cigar. Apparel plant. (laughs) It's a cigar. Okay, so we drive. Yes. We're on the road. Oh, this is a song about skunky Got it. This is just a cigar. Right? And Aurora starts to sing loudly as she travels on the road. It's how she do. Uh, it's, you know. Does she sing well? <laughs> she must. I wish I was in Zorro and Lovely She's a dancer. It's, uh, it's not great, but her commitment to it oh, is, 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 is like... I appreciate that. Yeah, right? You know, when you go to karaoke and it's someone who's like, hey, that's pretty good, but you're going for it and that's all that matters. Yeah. Do spirit. I recognize the song? That she's singing? Yeah. Real history? Advantage? Yes. Burick rolled advantage. <laughs> 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 
rolled a one and a two. <laughs> and a one, two, three. <laughs> you do. It's a song from the countrysides of Orleana. Oh, I would be singing along then. You join in. Roll performance. Oh, crap. <laughs> <laughs> Twelve. Pretty good. You guys are... You're good match. You're. Yeah. <laughs> you're having a good time. You guys are. You know when you're in the car and the jam comes on the radio and you just give her. That's you guys right yeah. now. <laughs> yeah. Oh my oh, god. You know there, you know there are others of us here too, right? Like, you know, I should have refilled my wine skin. Yeah, at least Bale's probably muffling it for you guys. <laughs> <laughs> god, let's kill a headache right now. You do. Let's, uh, yeah, let's keep going. I'm going to stick a long skinny piece of jerky in my mouth and pretend like I'm a cowboy and just chew on it like a piece of cud. Be like, where did you get jerky from? It's mine from my ration. Oh, okay, but he has them. It's not like dried ear piece that didn't make the cut? No. Okay, just Do you jerky. mean like a minotaur? Exactly. What is a cowboy? Oh, I am a cowboy. <laughs> and well, that's and a <laughs> way. <laughs> Blunted. Let me know. <laughs> okay, okay. Okay. I'm surprised it's not as large. You guys have been through that. Yeah, it's, it is it's done. done. It's You're on the end. Okay, so you guys are moving. You travel along. It's actually not that far to get to the estates, especially with uh. the horses. Um, it's d you. Oh, so cute. Um, and you feel that you are definitely moving uphill. Okay. <laughs> and as especially people in the carts, you're noticing that it's quite a bumpy path. So it's not a very comfortable ride. Oh my god. But as you get close to the Vernau estate, there is a very large gate. Uh. The large V, symbol that you recognize. Hi. And you can see up the hill a very large home, manor, mm. very castle like. And there are white tents set up. There are movement in the distance, servants, preparations. The one guard at the gate sees the two wagons approach. Hello! <laughs> He does not say hello back. Uh, hey. He has um, a very large list of acceptable names. Oh. And he looks up to all four of you. What do we, what do we got here? Uh, well, uh, this is a delivery from the Lazy Bee. It's all ale that Aurora's bringing. I'm speaking for her for some reason. Aurora. Von Faffelson. <laughs> She's like, oh. hello, yeah, right. that's me. Yes, from the Lazy Bee. All the ale for the wedding, summer wheat ale. And uh, I'm a friend of uh, Dolan's. And, What's your name? Uh, my name is Rurik. Rurik. You're, not, you're not on the list, Rurik. Uh, no, but I recovered his missing wine. Hmm. Which is what that cart driven by my friend Seno Vestos. Hello! <laughs> we've got the wine, uh, as led already, it was uh, Dallin's, it went uh, missing, and we've got it here. Yeah. I was talking to Dallin yesterday at the uh, estate in Ellurin. Hello, my name is Seno Vestos Sam. Yeah. Here for the way. Oh, my. Yeah, so we're just gonna come on in. Got lots of good wine, got lots of good beer. Why do you have a child strange thing with you? Hi, top of the morning to you. What's you your name? Sanguina. She's my help. That's right. She's my ward. That's right. You know, I, she, she helps. I'm taking care of her, teaching her to grow up into a proper good adult. I'm being taught. Oh my god. <laughs> well, my good man, it's time for us to go. We gotta get this wine. Uh... He's really scared of you. No, but I'm enjoying you, my tiny little one. Children are scary. Yeah. Uh, my teeth are in. Okay, Children so should be seen in I just and inspect and I think we're gonna have to inspect. I'm gonna have to come aboard and inspect these cuts. Yeah, uh, here's the wine. Sure. You see, it's good wine. Uh, you know, you got a cut here. We got the wine. Okay, I come over. He comes over and he starts going through it all. He's looking through. There's 
I think you should open up these crates. These ones? Sure, right now. Oh, that's great. Shows the wine. Take a sip. It's delicious wine. It's for the wedding. Hmm. Side note with Aurora. Hey, Aurora, are all of these, uh, are all of them empty? They're all empty. Crap. Uh, what are we going to do? Uh, do I think have, we should. Don't make a delivery Open order. me. Open me. Um... Open me. Uh, Did you order the, because they ordered the, the ale, right? Yeah, I didn't bring anything. I just, I don't know. Usually I just, you know, have a little shoulder and then a little leg and it's going to be great. It's going to be fine. Try that. Can Try I hear right? these? Yeah. Uh, you guys, no, you can't hear the whisper. Yeah, you probably they're, just, they're trying to be quiet. <laughs> but he finishes inspecting this first cart. Does he try a little bit? No. Tasty. It's delicious wine. It's it's stamped with Zelenda symbol. I, yeah. Yeah, but the rest of this looks like. Did you steal these things? They're just like random items from places. What is this even for? To be honest with you, uh, remember, Dallin's wine. It got stolen. Um, we recovered it, uh, so we're not really sure what some of the other stuff in this cart is. We just our focus was recovering the wine. Some of these and bringing looks the like for you. these are like some of Kaleva's items. Like, stuff from her house. But we're really? bringing them back to her. That is fascinating. You're gonna have to search for those thieves. And he looks over and he's like, that's nutmeg! You guys stole... <gasps> we did not! No, we found, we're here. They found nutmeg. We found that's nutmeg. Right. We rescued nutmeg who was wandering in the forest. Yeah, it was down by the lake. Oblivious to sound. Can I hear this? You you hear this now. If I weren't... I'm we... a pop-up. No! No! Oh. <laughs> you pop out of the barrel and he goes, Hello! Oh! Sorry, I'm a friend of Kaleva's. I hear she's in dire danger and I need to, I, like, we gotta go. I need thieves. to get some attention. No, it's not these. No, 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 no. Thieves. I'm gonna starts... roll for charisma. Always. Always. <laughs> nope. Uh, Aurora also <laughs> rolls for charisma. Cause she's, oh, she rolls good. She's trying to like, toss her skirts aside. Look, there's beautiful thighs. <laughs> beautiful thighs. <laughs> Um, oh, uh, that's God. an 11, so I'm going to roll for intimidation. This is not working. He starts, he's like, I'm just going to stay in my bed. Fuck these people. Uh, <laughs> he starts to run back to the gates. He's like, none of you are allowed in. And you'll stay I'm here. I'm going to bust out. I have noble position of privilege here. He should be inclined to do what I say because I'm clearly a noble. Roll. Uh, uh, with advantage? Okay. On a persuasion. I'm gonna try and persuade, persuade if this fails. Oh, Fifteen. Uh, you know what? That's pretty good, though. Like he's he's he calms down. He's like, oh, oh. okay, so you have to come with me, and we'll talk to them. Yes, of course. Let's do this. Oh. Uh, do it's we... just me. I I <clears throat> this is just I have a me little paper. What is, what what is in the major? rest of the barrels? Oh. No, there's nothing in the rest um, of the barrels. It's just on. me. This, okay, I'm wait, going. I'm going to go talk to people. All these barrels. All right. Of... All right. What's your name? My name is Nils. All right, Nils. Look, I'm a special agent of Harover now. <laughs> you don't brand this onto your hand unless you have a deep connection. Now you're gonna let us in here, or there's going to be trouble. Hmm. I've never. Roll. Persuasion. <laughs> or intimidation. <laughs> oh, come on. That was such a good performance. Uh, <laughs> you can roll an advantage. Okay, sweet. I'm going to go persuasion. Broke my thing. Ooh. Oh, that's a 24. He's calm, but intimidated, scared. And he looks between the two of you and he's like, you should come and explain yourselves. Look, there's... Everyone knows what's going on. You need to not ruin this. The people hidden in the barrels, there's more than one, are a surprise for the grooms. They can't be here without them knowing. Or sorry, they have to be here without them knowing. <laughs> I said it wrong. And we found Dolan's wine. I was, as a special agent, I was tasked with that. We found it. Some people are dead now. You don't want to join them. Yo. And Aurora peeks her head around. She's like, and I'm a detective. She's huh. a detective. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want we to. We deputized her. Yeah. You don't want to have it on your back to ruin the surprise. 
This is the greatest thing this that's going to happen. This is far bigger than you, Nils. That's why it's the day before the wedding. That's this right. is some real last minute secrets. It's so important. This job is fucked up. It is. And he unlocks the gate and he pushes the doors open and he's like, uh. You know what? I, did, I, just, I didn't even see you guys. Don't speak a word. Yeah. Sounds good. And mm-hmm. I'm going to grab my paladin flap. And I don't even know who you are anymore. I don't yeah. know what's happening. Yep. Yeah. And you put it under your head. Hey, horses come in and he's just like, fuck. Uruk, good job. He just tosses the list behind him. <laughs> <laughs> metagame, metagame. I was getting ready to roll initiative. Did oh! you see me? I was like, here we go. I'm not taking this thing out. Wait. Shoot a hole in my barrel. Quickly. Pull your men back. Oh. And women. And women. I'm a woman. I was trying to do the whole time. Wow, man. Wow, do you know, man. It's a it's stated it. feature. <gasps> Look at Oh, oh. Hey, this looks familiar. On this, the day of my daughter's wedding. <laughs> <laughs> uh, sons. Oh, sons sorry, yeah, sons, sons, yeah. Sons. I forgot. Right. Look how beautiful these tents are. Oh, it's magnifique. Magnifique. <laughs> oh, yes. Everyone's. Miniatures. Uh, Aaron's always break dancing. I love this mini. She falls over, lying <laughs> oh, prone. Oh, cool. It's quite so violent. Oh, oh, it. oh, I'm it. having fun sliding. Let's <laughs> <laughs> back it up. I got Seno. One more with you. Still. In her dancing dress. Oh! oh. It's it's and Giggity. you see the entertainment in front of you. Oh. Hey girl. You can only see her from the back right now. Amelie! Hello! Oh. <laughs> You've never seen this dwarf carry such a burden on her shoulders. Amelie, what's happened? Where's Kaleva? And she turns to look at you when she sees you all. Immediately her features return to the cranky dwarf you know her as, because she would never want you to see struggle or pain on her face. That's how there Emily is. is. <laughs> <laughs> At least she wasn't up on the table this time. <laughs> <laughs> oh my and God. she's about to tell you something. Oh. But that oh. will be Don't for next time! Oh, 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 is it possible? God damn it! <sighs> so close. Now I've uh, got the blue ball. I <laughs> hope so. <laughs> some gin. I need some of her gin. Mm-hmm. Very badly. Really? Woo. I see in hindsight now that I was not supposed to pop out of the barrel. Fuck! <laughs> 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 oh, oh, no. Only now? I'm a what? good person! <laughs> I, was like, <laughs> I was like, oh, oh shit. Oh, yeah, I but I'm her friend, I can talk her out. People will listen. That guard doesn't give a shit about you.